Hi, my name's Kevin, um, Kevin Darling, and I am video recording the next 30 days of this diet that I'm trying to start, not diet, life changing plan or whatever you want to call it. Um, but so it's called the Whole 30. This is the book right there, Whole 30, and it's by uh, Melissa and Dallas Hartwig. They're a couple, wonderful book. I recommend it. Um, I read about it and heard about it. Sorry, I'd heard about it before I read about it. And then it just kept coming up when I would go to the grocery store. I'm running into a friend I hadn't seen in a while, like online. So I said, give the book a try. And actually one of my coworkers started it and that really encouraged me to give it a shot. Things that really drew me, I'm not gonna lie, yes, weight loss is obviously one of them, especially now that I'm in my 30s. Um, I've noticed that my midsection has gotten a little bit bigger. Um, it's harder to keep it off. Um, my skin's always been a problem. You probably can't tell right now, but I do suffer from, you know, acne. Um, it's something that I've always suffered from since I was 18. I actually didn't get it as a teenager, but I did get it as an adult. And I'm 31 now, and I really don't want acne. <laughs> One of the things that really drew me when I started reading the book was that it's supposed to help with your skin because you're getting rid of all those bad foods. And I have tried this other place that also talks about dietary restrictions to improve your acne, and I did it, and you know, then I went back on those bad foods. And ironically enough, a lot of those bad foods are in this book, so hopefully I'll see a change in my skin as well. Um, so those are my personal goals, is um, getting my body in shape um, and to uh, eat and feel better. Um, my husband is joining me on this trip um, to a better life, and his goals are better digestion, because um, he always has tummy issues. We want to make sure that he enjoys the food he eats and um, you know isn't suffering for it later. Um, so the hard part for me is going to be doing all the cooking and meal prepping, but today's day one. Um, I was going to take a picture of what I made for breakfast, but I didn't. It was really simple, so I'll just tell you what I did. So uh, the first thing I did was I got organic eggs. You don't have to get organic eggs, but Trader Joe's has them for like less than $2. And for me, I'm like, oh, that's great. And they're really, really big. Um, so I did that. So I did scrambled eggs. Um, I diced up some tomato and some onion first, and I sauteed it with some ghee. So you're not allowed to need dairy, but clarified butter is the only exception to that dairy rule. So that's why I got clarified butter. And there is organic clarified butter and there is non-organic. This is non-organic. The organic shit is like really expensive. Sorry for cussing. Um, it's about like six, seven dollars. This is like two dollars at Trader Joe's and I'm tr on a budget, okay? Lady on a budget. Um, scrambled eggs and then I did sausage. So it's really hard to find sausage that doesn't already have sugar in it. So I googled a lot of recommendations and one of them was um, just read the label. I hate reading the label, I know, but just read it. And Trader Joe's makes it really simple. I'm not at all affiliated with Trader Joe's. I just happen to live really close to one. So this one is a uh, garlic herb sausage, right there, chicken sausage. And I'm gonna read you the ingredients and you can look at them here too if you wanna take a quick snap at that. So the ingredients say uh, chicken that contains less than 2% salt, parsley, roasted onions, roasted garlic, celery, juice powder, Marjong, I don't even know what that is. More, more, mar. I'm, not, I'm gonna stop reading. Oregano, black pepper, white pepper, natural uh, pork casing. So, no sugar. And it actually says zero sugar here. Um, it does have sodium, but sodium's okay with the dirty thirty. No, I'm kidding. It's called the whole thirty. <laughs> um, so that's what I made for breakfast. Jesse really liked that. And you are allowed to have fruit, which really excited me because, like, God, you know. You're trying to change their mindset that you don't treat yourself with sweetness, but it's, you know, at least natural fruit you can get away with. And you can also have nuts. So for breakfast, I also um, sliced up some of these yummy pears from Trader Joe's. Again, not promoting Trader Joe's, it's just, that's where I got them. Um, and then some raspberries. Um, and I just diced it up. And I was actually pretty hearty and I'm really full. You can have coffee, just no sugar. And a long time ago, I stopped drinking my coffee with sugar, so I'm okay, or cream, I don't really need it. Um, but if you're looking for a good tea, this is my favorite tea. I actually got this not at Trader Joe's, but at uh, Pete's. <laughs> Pete's, I got it at Pete's, and it's called um, the Organic African Nectar. It's so delicious. I started drinking this a while back ago on accident. I wanted tea, I was trying to get off coffee because I was feeling like, ooh, you know? So none of that. It's herbal, um, it has no caffeine in it, and it was very um, 
yummy. Like it's got a sweet taste. And I've learned in the past, like anything that says rooibos in it is just delicious. And the Mighty Leaf is the brand, even though I got this at Trader Joe's. And yes, it's expensive. You might be able to find it cheaper online. So if you want to do that, that's fine. And I'm kind of bougie and I like my loose leaf. But um, they also sell them in the tea bags already if that's what you would prefer. And I need to stop looking down. Like I realize you're over there. You're over there. And I'm going to pause for a minute because I need to blow. And we're back, I think. Okay, it's on. Okay, the green light's on. Um, so I don't even know why I kept recording now because I'm pretty much done. I think I said everything I needed to say. I will be editing these videos and making them smaller because I talk too much. I'm perfectly aware of that. So, yeah. Wish us luck.